Hello everyone, this is Yamin and in this tutorial I am going to show you how you can show alert message with the close button in Laravel using Ajax. So here uh, you can see that I have a title and description input field and I have a add button. So when you click this add button, it will show us a alert message at the top that data uploaded successfully with a close button. And if you click the close button, it will close the message. So we will do it using Ajax. Okay, so uh, first of all, uh, where we want to show the message? We want to show the message at the top. So here, for this, what we'll do is that we'll just go to our code. And here, uh, inside the center tag, we'll just mention a div over here. And inside this div, we need to mention an ID. Let's say over here, ID name will be show message. So inside this div, we'll show the alert message. So right now, let's save this. So when we are going to show the alert message when the upload is successful. So here you can see that uh, we have the Ajax code and when the upload is success only then we will show the alert message. So here we are going to mention a function name. Let's say here function name will be alert message. You can name it basically anything. Then we will give two first bracket to single quotation and from here we can send a message. Let's say here just upload success. So right now what we'll do is that we'll write a function called alert message and we'll also catch this message which is upload success. So we can just uh, write the function inside the same script but just so you can understand it clearly I'll just make a different script over here. So inside this script first of all we'll mention the function and the function name is this one alert message. So we'll say here alert message to first bracket and here we'll say message. So what it will do is that it will, this variable will catch this message which is alert success. Okay. So right now we'll give to second bracket and after this we'll say over here dollar to first bracket to single quotation and we'll say over here hash. So what do we want to show this message? We want to show this message uh, inside this div here you can see and here you can see for this div the id is show message so we'll write this id over here okay so since this is id we need to give hash and after this we'll say over here dot html then we'll give to first bracket so inside this two first bracket we're going to have a div and inside that div we'll have the message and the close button so here uh, we'll make it like this. Okay, so after this we'll give to single quotation and inside this single quotation We'll say over here div opening and inside this div we're going to mention class Equal to to double quotation and here we'll say alert alert this arrow sign. Let's say primary and The role it will be alert role equal to alert so after this to single quotation here in order to show the masses we need to give a plus sign and here we are going to mention this message and inside this message we have this value which is upload success so here we'll say plus let's just say it, write it like this message then again we'll give a plus and right now we'll write the code for the close button so for the close button again we'll give to single quotation and here we'll say here button this arrow sign opening and button closing then inside this button we're going to say we'll set type equal to button then class will be class equal to btn close after this we'll say here data bs dismiss equal it will be alert then again we will also say area minus sign level equal to close so this will automatically give us a close button but let's just show over here and times semicolon so this will also give us a close button so after this again we just need to close the div so before that we'll give a plus sign over here then to single quotation and we'll just simply close the div so let me just explain this again so here at the top over here inside this div we want to show the message alert message so here uh, when the upload is successful then it will call this function alert message upload success and then this function will call the div whose id is show message which we just write at the top over here you can see so it will uh, call that div and then it will show us a design with the message and we'll also have a close button okay so right now if we save this then if we now refresh here 
and if you now write something over here okay one more thing that is i haven't added any bootstrap cdn link over here okay so right now if you click add it will show us it like this and the button on close so for it we need to add the bootstrap cdn link so for it uh in order to get the bootstrap cdn link we'll go to get bootstrap.com over here don't go to any other place just go over here get bootstrap.com and from here if we just go down you will see the cdn link here you can see two cdn link on for css and on for uh, bundle mill dot js on for js okay so we need to copy both of them so first of all we'll copy the css then we'll paste it at the head section of our code after that we'll uh, copy this script which is js this one and then we'll uh, paste it over here so right now if we save this then if we now refresh here and let's just add some random things here and if you click add over here here you can see the design over here we have the close button and here you can see that width is too big so we can make it smaller if you click close it will close the message so let's just say over here uh, inside this tip let's say here style we'll say here width it will be it will be 30 percent and save it then let's just refresh here say random things click add and here you can see and there you can see there's actually two close button because uh we already mentioned over here over here you can see for the button area level close that's why so we can just remove this at the end of times let's save this and let's refresh here then let's say something then click add here you can see we have only on close button right now so here uh, what we are doing is that we are just sending the message from this function so right now what if you want to send the message from the controller you can do that as well so here uh, we just say over here success equal to two so in order to send the message from the controller what you need to do is that we'll just give a comma over here we say over here message then we'll give this equal and arrow sign to single quotation and let's say over here data upload it successfully then we need to catch this message in the welcome.bait.php over here so here uh, we mentioned the variable is message so here you can see that uh, alert message so we need to remove the upload success with the single quotation and here you can see success function result so here first of all we'll say result dot message and here this message will come from the home controller from here okay so it will get the message then call this function alert message and it will do and this function will do his own things okay so save this again and let's just refresh here let's say something description click add here you can see data uploaded successfully with the close button so this is how you can add bootstrap alert message with close close button in laravel using as a so i hope you find this tutorial easy and simple if you have any question you can always let me know in the comment section and if you want more tutorial like this then make sure to subscribe i will also really appreciate that as well thanks again for watching see you in the future tutorial